was there a minute ago. Oh my God. <sighs> so that's okay. Cause that happens sometimes. Look, I, I like not even wearing my apron cause I was gonna give up. And I was like, you know what? <sighs> One more. Sometimes we just need a win. You know what I mean? Clearly. Uh, so I just finished the previous video um, with the black and the blues and um, paints are falling. And it was really frustrating. My phone literally shot off like 20 times during the whole thing. It was a nightmare, whatever. And I, <laughs> I was like, oh, gonna be easy breezy. I was not easy breezy. I'm just posting the final results because I'm not actually going to post the video because it was kind of a disaster. So this was a two footer. And what happened, the reason it looks so wonky is because my phone kept dying every two minutes and like everything was melting and I was tilting and it was just horrible. But there's something. First of all, I love these colors over the black base, um, but I decided to keep it. Not sure what I'm going to do with it, but I know it's not YouTube worthy. And then I was like, I'm just going to do a bloom because at least people will be happy. And like, it's fine. Again, we love the colors, but execution, not great. So not a great painting day all in all, but back to the video. Um, so this one, I'm not really going to be easy breezy. Let's, you know, be honest. But we're gonna have some fun because I decided I have a lot of blues mixed up. I don't even know what most of them are, so don't ask me. But we're just going all blue because I got the blues. Get it? So how am I gonna show you my blues? It wasn't very um, smart of me. So I have this little, hmm, could be 10 incher. And I'll just tell you what I have. Now, most of them, I don't know um, their color. But I'm just gonna like use them. Oh, you can't see what I'm doing. I'm gonna use them all, and I don't care. And I'm gonna do like my um, kind of like I call it like my alcohol ink layering, where I kind of fan them out. Um, so here are my blues. Now I will add a bit of sparkle because why not? So I'm gonna add my Mer Jesus Christ. <laughs> my mom just sorry. <laughs> Okay, my mom's like a mouse, okay? She just appeared out of the corner. I'm already high strung. I was just telling the, the previous video the horrible experience. It was horrible. She had to leave after because I kept trying to, to tape a good bloom and it wouldn't happen. So, mom, this is called All the Blues. All the Blues, love it, jazz hands. Jazz hands. So I was saying I'll probably also add some sparklies. I'm just gonna do like a layered bloom, Mama, so you might not like it. But I'm glad you're here for some moral support. <laughs> oh, you can choose. Yes. The layering, like, do you want to go? Okay, so we can go like darks to lights, lights, darks, or just bloop, whatever. Because I'm gonna do like a accordion fan. I don't like. I like. Tell me if this is possible. I yep. like the lights to darks. If you have any translucent that the lights can come through, perhaps it's not possible. It's it is so good question, Mamar. Most of my paints are actually semi-transparent when you're doing the bloom you don't want to do too much opaque i know that this teal is opaque and that's how you get my peacock cells being that but that's what makes it break through okay. so yes good so let us let us do this i'll just go down we don't need to be fancy anymore right don't worry about all this black paint okay oh man okay here we are so i've got my Pillow paint, glitter, any central eggshell. Am I going white or dark? Hmm. I'll go white. Glitter, any central eggshell. Okay. You know, mom. Some days. Some days are retro days. Do you know what Elliot said to make me feel better? What? Of course, it was a sports analogy, which means nothing to me. But he did say Michael Jordan missed most of his shots. Oh, most really? of them. Really. And. Michael Jordan missed all of the shots where he didn't try. You see? Got Meaning, it. Meaning, keep going. Got it. <laughs> Don't give up. You know? The little engine that could, sweetheart. The little engine that could not, but kept trying. <laughs> so positive today <laughs> during our Metro retrograde. Metro retrograde. Mercury retrograde always kills me. Okay. Here's my white. So I'm going to start with a few tubies. Does it matter that there's bloops? No, because these are going to go. Okay. I think we'll start with a mid, okay? This is such a weird color. 
I think this is Delft Blue, um, Old Holland, but isn't this a funny color? Quite cold. Quite cold indeed. Oh, this lighting's horrible. I didn't check the lighting before. What's the difference between these two? So that is Payne's Gray Golden, um, and this is Delft Blue. I so see. It's, right. You see the difference? Yes. Um, we're just going to, so I'm going to accordion. Ready? Loopity bloop, like this. And then, you know what? I'm not painting anymore today. After this. You know? Bloopity bloop. We're just like having fun now. Exactly. Don't, doesn't this sound fun to you? Today is Fun Day Monday. Fun Day? It is Fun Day Monday. Oh gosh. Take a deep breath in. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> okay. So here's my three blues. This I believe is um, gold and cobalt teal. To be honest, not sure about this one. And I think that's the old Holland Delft blue. Let's go for some golds. Or you know what I could do is, which I'll probably do, I'll accordion the sparkly. So this is TLP ore, okay? This is TLP mermaid. This little piggy from Fluid Art Company. It's wonderful when you're using just values a little bit up and a little bit down. It makes we'll see. it more complex. You think? Mm -hmm. We'll see if it works. TLP Velvet, which is a blue interference. So let's go with the top layers. Now, I'll use this one already. So as I said, this one's opaque. And because we're not really going to make a lot of peacock cells, this one's the opaque one. Um, you know, I want to be careful and not put too much of this. Just like that. Okay. Then, this this is a custom color I made with uh, uh, zinc white and phthalo green, just a little mint green, okay? Then we will do the um, Payne's Gray, okay? Then we will do gold and phthalo turquoise. There, that could be fun, right? Mm -hmm. She's not sure yet. No way. Oh. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. So we could do white cell activator or we can do both. Hmm. I don't know how to do both. So the way I'm going to layer it is I'm going to do my Payne's Gray cell activator first. That's right there on the top. Will you pass that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to do white on top. So this is Australian Floatrol and Amsterdam Payne's Gray. About three to one. I don't measure. I like it quite thick. Okay, so we're gonna go bloop, okay. Then, oh, thank you, I just don't wanna get you dirty. We're gonna go bloop. Are you ready? Yes. Me too. Oh, shoot. Okay. Whew. I just got dizzy. All right. What do you think? It's happening. Marv isn't certain yet. She's looking in horror at the cells forming. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on in her mind? I wonder. The crowd goes <laughs> silent. <laughs> the stadium goes silent. Okay. We see sparkle of the ore. Well, Marva's saying, ew. Uh, no, oh. Okay, I find this area interesting. Yes, me too. I agree. I really like that okay. area. This area is looking yep. interesting as this is. Oh, you like that one? Mm -hmm. We don't like the middle. Mm -hmm. Kind of boring. Now, a question for perhaps, perhaps you've done this already, or perhaps yep. for the future. Uh -huh. Instead of using white uh, cell activator, oh, base, base paint, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. or cell activator, mm -hmm. have you tried to tone it down with a bit of beige? Because the white is rather stark on all the pieces. So most of the time, you don't see it it at all oh, mm -hmm. unless you do a negative but if you do like negative or you do a big one and you want negative you can use any color you want really um but you see what's going to happen is all you're really going to see is this area here right so but i'm going to do something fun we're going to wreck it okay i'm taking a skewer i love wrecking i know so because i'm not really crazy about it but what are you going to do the flower 
Same old flower. Same old power. flower. <laughs> oh my god. No, no. What if it was a landscape? What if it was well, a I cityscape? How, what if it was? <laughs> Mamar, how am I supposed to make this a cityscape? Well, let's look. Or, or well, let's. let's ah, <laughs> that's what she <you> gets. <laughs> I hear what you're saying, but in this. One day, one day, I'd love you to try different things instead of flowers. I'm not actually doing a flower right now. Oh, okay. Kind of. <laughs> it does, it does look like a flower. I'm no, no. I, <laughs> it's true, but this, like, when, if you start doing swipes or you start stretching, you can definitely get cool shapes and stuff. Um, but not from blowing in the middle out, really. I mean, I, I suppose we could stretch it out, um, but. So you mean you're not gonna come to the end with the blues? Yeah, it's, so, so there's a lot of paint still on here, mm -hmm. so I still have to spin it, and all the edges are right. really gonna come off. So that's why I, the middle is kind of what's important. Mm -hmm. See, this is boring me, but. pretty we'll see so now are you ready to s mm. we'll see okay ready mm -hmm. move out of the way a little mm. bit I should move my paints out of the way I'm not crazy about this one but like we'll see also in the light because we can't see the sparkle totally Ooh, the velvet looks really good I will say but yes I, I love the different shapes and stuff Instead of just doing boring old flowers all the time, right? Mm. I do like this edge the best. Which edge? This one. So, careful. I know, I know. I'm not finished yet. No, I, you're not. I'm just trying to look oh. at before you jump in. Mm -hmm. So this is looking interesting for this. Yes. Kind of for me. That's right. This would be the bottom, but yeah. still, unfortunately for you, I still got to spin. Okay. Oops. Oopsie, sorry. Okay. Here we go. Wait, let's move my paints a little bit more. And that is the thing. Sometimes within the fluid art, you can, you can only control so much, you know? Um, sparkle looks good, I will say. It is a boring kind of thing. You know, mm -hmm. but also I want to show. So, see when I tilt it, look at this color. Can you see the velvet yeah. mm -hmm. and the sparkle is really pretty. So, the sparkles are good. It's just my shapes, which are. Well, at this point, I don't think I'd have white left. No, we gotta keep spinning, anyways. Yeah. So I keep spinning until when I tilt it, the middle does not move anymore. It's nice lacing at the edges. Yeah, that's actually nice when I can, at least it's not one big flower. It yes. looks like a flower yeah. growing. You know what? I don't hate it. No, I don't hate it. Okay. I'm not going to say I hate it. I'm going to say I like it's it fine. more than if it was like a, a, a blue big flower. One, yeah, one, yeah, one. yeah. Very pretty, actually. Very delicate. Okay. Like leaves. Very All delicate right. work. Yeah. Very beautiful pearlescent. And yes. Let's see if any of the colors came through uh, the lighter through to the top did they well the in this light it's very hard. yes well it's hard to see because really there's only three layers because remember right. I, went, I went like i you did can see some delicate things yes happening here. yeah it's a lot of there's depth the loops of, where's the bloops here oh no that's not a bloop what is it that's just la the bubbles. layers of paint there's no bubble oh oh yes you see some bubbles there yes they will i'll pop those whoopsie okay <laughs> let me take you guys okay i'm not hating this so let me take you guys to the light and you can see the sparkle. Um, what do you guys think of my, I've got the blues, you know? Thanks, Mamarv. Should Mamarv continue to bug me? Yes. <laughs> Bye.